channel my name is christine okosu today is another regina the last reaction i'm excited i did my first reaction to her i love that song i love her voice this is a woman who understands the art of singing she has a very beautiful instrument she knows how to pass the beauty of her instrument to others the joy of it and she has very good technique so like i always say let's talk more reaction i'm excited because this is a song that i heard when i was little so i'm going to have some childhood blues going on let's talk more reaction. every single word she sings it from a true place she understands the words she understands she, she she's making believe like we watch make believe movies that makes us like ah oh, this is a real dinosaur or something she's owning the lyrics and she is engulfing us in a fixated way like I can hear her. I can hear what she's saying. I can relate. Not the aimless show of show off of unnecessary vocal trills and runs in a musical, please. And not the unnecessary sustaining like some mood I've done held out wear for a ridiculous amounts of time. I'm like, what is happening? This is this is someone who's she's so real, she's so authentic. And of course, according to what I learned, she was the first and in love of this new artist like uh, Morissette. Hey girl, I love her. Katrina, I love them. Learned from her. And I hope they all learned very well. So far, so good. None can match her. That's just the truth. Because she has years of experience and I'll stop there and enjoy the rest. <laughs> You see, she knows when to employ elements of whisper and combination of speech to paint this color because she understands the meaning. She knows what the song is about and she wants us to share in the joy of the lyrics of what the song is about. It's a musical. So even if you have all the all whole commands of truths and trends, do not turn people off by doing a musical in a way that is like R and B or like way to just suit your ego or the craving of whatever audience that doesn't have an understanding of how a musical should be presented mwah, mwah. this woman stands out oh my god i love her i love her i love morissette i love diana could you know her I, I, yeah she just i mean i love them all <laughs>
respect this lady. <laughs> a lot of singers will just take that break and make it sound as if, make it look as if, okay, the piano interval is different from them. Okay, the piano has finished. Okay, now let me come. There's always this, there's often this separation between the accompaniment and the vocals. They make it feel as if it's all about me. It's a team work and this woman understands it. At that point, the piano had that interval. She was already put her, she was already in the music because that was paving way for the next emotion and the next story that she's coming with on a new phrase. So she was there emotionally and she was there physically. You can see it now. Look, let me go back a bit. I said she understands the arts and it's not... said that this woman is Regine Villas oh my god she did not go to any conservatory there's something about the art of music is either you have it as an innate gift or you learn it any which way they're both good but you see those with innate gifts they can paint stories because God has gifted them with natural understanding of painting colors and understanding when to breathe where to sing over the rest she is i said at the beginning that she understands the art a r t art of singing of performance and she has the heart to share her gifts and she has the voice so these three combinations she makes her a total instrument on her own. I kid you not. At that point, some might be ignorant and think it's all about them and they're not connected with the instrumental. Because at that point, it's like, it's a duet between her and the pianist. I wish a real, I wish real strings were used, but hey, this is still okay. They forget that this is it was between the instrument and you so there must be that perfect sync when the instrument is telling a story preempting your own face that is about to come in you're still in character you're still in character both emotionally and mentally so now launch out to do your thing and that's the exact thing she did at that point oh my god uh. bravissimo 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 I wish the vocal, the, the other vocals that came in, I did not really like them. <laughs> but anyway, they have to make use of what they have. I wish it was a real string instrument. Regardless of all that, made her voice comes in, you forget about what you did not like about whatever uh, uh, other thing they threw in. And her voice just fills everything up.
Oh my goodness, see what I was saying? This is someone who understands the art. Please bear in mind that this was recorded from someone's maybe obviously mobile device. And I can still feel the impact like this. This was done about six years ago or thereabouts. And I can still feel the impact like this. Imagine what will happen to those who are blessed to listen to her real life. I'm just getting like a scrap of the magic of listening to her in real life and real time. My heart's off to her. Bravissima. That part, they look like the Phantom of the Opera, that picture there. Okay. She sings very sweetly. Dolce. Dolce. Sweet singing. I love her voice. I love her interpretation. I love that fact that she, she has a good understanding of the art. You know, a lot of people just cheer for the high voices, high notes, and they don't get to appreciate the whole journey she has taken off us through it's not just about the high and if you like the high how did she deliver the high she delivered the high notes very healthily with good chest coordination look at the journey from the beginning look at the journey so magical she got us all entranced and that's one thing one thing i don't like about live performance some people will always cough hey for those of you who cough seize your cough and stop distracting us please seize hold it Swallow it. I paid to watch her sing, not to hear your cough enter enter my video or enter my ears. So, if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell to let you know more. I would like to see another version of this with strings. If you know of any version that has live strings, not um keyboard act voicing the strings, I would love to hear that. I love this live performance. It was done years ago. She was recorded from a mobile device and yes, I was still impacted like this. So imagine if I get to hear a live or from a, a, a version that was not recorded through a mobile device, whatever. She's still magical. She still, she still comes out to you, like listening to me. So I love her so much. Subscribe, hit the notification bell to let you know when I upload such videos and please be safe out there. Peace, love, and joy.